What is good everybody, it is your boy Super Saiyan Cat back with another skill test video for you guys today. We got Burst Kamehameha going up against Super Explosive Wave and of course on the last skill test video, this skill test had the most votes on it so continue to leave your suggestions and votes down below guys so we can get to future skill tests. But one quick thing before we get this skill test started guys, if I have not already uploaded the video on the rules um, for the Cabby Squad Tournament skill preliminaries and things like that when they're going to be held, I'll have that video out for you guys today. Again, if it's not up already, it will be out for you guys at some point today, so stay tuned for that for those who have been waiting on the Cabby Squad, the next Cabby Squad Tournament skill because I know a lot of people didn't get to participate in the first one because they didn't know about it. And now they're going to have the chance for this second one. So I just want to let you guys know in advance that the video will be out today if it's not already out now. But now, let's get into the skill test between Burst Command Mare and Super Explosive. Alright guys, we're going to get the skill test started the same way as always. First testing out for damage, then speed. Then we're going to talk about uses for these moves before we take them online to the rank scene. And we're going to get it started with Super Explosive Way. But one thing to keep in mind with this move, it do, it's damage varies depending on how close or far you are from your opponent as you see right here it does 2151 damage with a seven hit combo but when you get close to your opponent as close as possible it does 2529 damage with a 10 hit combo so again the most damage you're going to get from this move is 2529 with a 10 hit combo and that's when you are as close to your opponent as possible burst command Mea is the same exact way it also does less hits and damage the farther you are from your opponent as you saw that was without the burst it did a five hit combo for 1138 damage when you get up close it actually does 11 hits for 1894 damage so that's just one thing to keep in mind with these moves but again super explosive wave at its max does 2529 and burst command man at its max is a 23 hit combo let's try and get that right here okay i just missed my timing a little bit come on i need the 23 hits uh that's 22 doing 3667 let's try and get that 23 again and we got it and it does a total of 3,793 damage. So clearly Burst Command Mea is by far the stronger move. But again guys, the damage will vary depending on how close or far you are from your opponent with these moves. Now when you talk about speed of these moves, Super Explosive Wave I feel is a little bit faster than Burst Command Mea. Not only with release time, but the actual speed of the, um, the beam. It's definitely faster than Burst Command Mea just by a little bit, not too much. But it definitely does take the edge when it comes to speed. Now when you talk about uses for these moves guys, both of these moves can be used into knockdown with knockdown attacks, but super explosive wave can be also be used for those who people who like to like bluff charging in or charge in like this. You can use super uh, super explosive wave with the backflip and just backflip on your opponent like that right there and hit them. They will be caught off guard sometimes. I've seen a lot of people land this move catching people off guard when they're just charging in doing reckless stuff like this again you could just backflip with super explosive wave and hit them like that now that is not a guaranteed way to use the move that's just something that you can keep in mind with the move that you do have that backflip if you feel you can land it with that um super explosive wave now let's talk about the actual knockdown attack you can use any kind of knockdown combo with these moves guys any kind of knockdown combo they're both very fast and they'll always hit your opponent no matter what again they are very fast moves so you'll definitely land them off a knockdown combo now the one thing with super explosive wave as you see right here we're going to do it again same combo once they get hit with super explosive wave they don't instantly recover you see how trunks is stuck there lying on the ground and i was able to catch him to where he had to use stamina to get up that does not work the same for Burst Command Man. Usually most, any kind of key blast like that, any beam key blast, usually it sends your opponent flying to where they're able to recover without you being able to catch them, like you'll see right here for Burst Command Man. As you see right here with Burst Command Man, Trunks is about to go, okay, it didn't land for some reason, but as the second part landed still, and as you saw, Trunks went flying. That does not give you an opportunity to go catch him like you get with Super Explosive Wave. For some reason, when you use Super Explosive Wave off a knockdown combo, it's like your opponent is dead for a second. They just, they're just lying there on the ground, as, again, with Trunks. As you guys saw, he was just lying there on the ground, and you're able to dash towards them and catch them, and you can put them into another combo, or if they're pressing the X button trying to get up, they will use stamina to get up. So that's just something to keep in mind with super explosive wave when you use it off a knockdown attack but basically that's the way you want to use these moves guys again super explosive wave can be used against people who are just trying to charge and you can hit the backflip that's really when you want to use the backflip version of super explosive wave or you can just use it off a knockdown combo any knockdown combo 
the move will always land. It's not as safe with a knock away combo. You can use it off a knock away, but it will not land as much online just due to natural delay and lag. But now we're going to take both of these moves online to the rank scene. First match will be a burst command man. Second match will be a super explosive wave. And I will see y'all a bit. All right, now we're on the rank scene, guys. And like I said, first match will be with Burst Command Mail. Come on, Kyle Shin Tech. You already got hit awoken. Let's go, buddy. Come here. No, no, no. Don't don't just dash straight at me, you dumbass thing. Oh, come on. He, like, why? Why, Xenoverse? Why are you going to let the man vanish off to the side when he should have been right at me? And for those who were saying the, 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 the back, the turnaround glitch is not back, did you not just see what this man Kyle Shin Tech just did? He tried to back hit, and he back hit the opposite way. That is what you call a turnaround glitch, guys. For those who are saying it's not back, it is clearly back. Very clear. As you guys, I mean, you guys could just, you know, rewind. I can't obviously do that while I'm playing. But, you know, you just rewind and you'll see that that, that glitch is back. Take this, you bastard. What? What the fuck? Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 Xenoverse. That's some nonsense. That is some damn nonsense. Come here, damn it. That's crazy, bro. He was mid burst command man and he just got out the way like he could do that. I didn't know that was possible. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't know you could start getting hit by something and then, you know, when the, the, the second wave of it comes, you get out the way. That's just crazy. Come here, Kyle Shin. What the hell are you doing, bro? Come here. Oh, you blocking out. No, 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 dude. Come here. Way too easy, my dude. Take this. Get your ass up in the air. Oh, damn it. I tried to get away from it, but I couldn't. I was gonna say I'm wide open, my dude. Come here. Hey, good. Ah! <laughs> Bye. Get your ass on the ground and take that. You're not gonna get out of what, bro? That's twice. Okay. I mean, there's obviously some lag going on here, but you guys see that 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 is how burst command mail works. That's how you want to use it off a knockdown like that. That usually won't happen. Only happens with some nonsense like that's going on right here. But it is what it is. I can't do anything about that. Oh man, that's just crazy. Let's try and end it with the other one. Super explosive. Oh, wait, what up? What? He got a perfect block animation off that shit. What the hell is going on, bro? Like, what? This is crazy. This man literally threw a key blast, a giant key shit, and he got a perfect block. Come here, damn it. Say goodbye. You should have been dead a while ago. But that is how you want to use Burst Command May. You guys saw the lag, just let him out of it. But that's how you want to use it. This man really just quit. Really, nigga? I was about to just, you know, get ready to go on to the next match, and this man just quits. What the hell is wrong with people? The dude didn't even have 10k BP. So that means he only lost but like 10 BP to play me. And he still quits? What is this world coming to? All right, now we're gonna be using super explosive wave and hopefully this man right here doesn't rage quit. Like I just, please, somebody try and explain to me what the hell is the point of that? No, 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 Juicy, you're not gonna, no, 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 bro. I just told you you're not gonna do that. But what, 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 what goes through people's minds when they, when they rage quit, bro? Like, really, what are you thinking? My, did he just try and grab me off using, like, what? I've never seen. Okay, he, he got it that time, but that's because he didn't land the actual knockaway part. Bro, this dude is just trying to grab his ass off. Like, damn, bro. Relax on the grab. Oh, shit. Damn it, I didn't even see him doing that. I would have perfect blocked it, but oh well. Bro, this dude is literally just trying to grab me. Like, what's wrong with this man? Get your ass on the ground. Take my super explosive wave. And like I said, guys, right after you... Uh, uh, that, damn it, I messed that up. But right after... Really? I'll just block it, I don't really care. But right after you use um, Super Explosive Wave, just charge straight in at your opponent because they will be staggered for a quick second. You'll have that opportunity to start up another combo. Damn it, I messed that up. But as you see, you still made him use a stamina. No, bro, you're not gonna break your own stamina. Thought that's what you were about to do. Get your ass on the ground. Will this end it? I don't think so. Come here, say goodbye. Oh, damn it, just, just keep him alive for nothing, Xenoverse, huh? Bro, this man was grabbing, though. But as you guys saw, that's how you want to use Super Explosive Wave off a knockdown and immediately afterwards charge at your opponent. As always, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Now, guys, let me know your thoughts on the video down below and continue to leave your votes and suggestions in the comment section so I can know which skill test you guys want me to do next. Now, honestly, in my opinion, guys, 
I know Burst Command Mayor does more damage, it does a lot more damage, but I like Super Explosive Wave more for this simple reason right there that I just showed. Again, like I said during the matches and during the actual like test part of the video, Super Explosive Wave is a move after you use it on a knockdown that your opponent's going to be left there hanging. He's just going to be left there looking like a dead duck sitting in the water. You're just charging straight after him and you're going to either force your opponent to use stamina or get another combo started if they don't want to use stamina. So for that simple reason right there is why I like Super Explosive Wave better because you can do more with it afterwards as opposed to Burst Command Mail when you use the move. Yes, it does more damage. Your combo will do more damage. But in the end, you're not going to be able to chase your opponent down and do some additional damage like you can with Super Explosive Wave. So for that simple reason, guys, is really why I like Super Explosive Wave more than Burst Command Mail. But let me know down below in the comments which move you like more between the two. I may be a minority that really just probably one of the only people that likes Super Explosive Wave over Burst Command Mail because Burst Command Mail does do about 1,300 to 1,500 more damage. But again, man, that the fact that you can make your opponent waste stamina or go into another combo immediately after you use Super Explosive Wave off a knockdown makes it that much more valuable online because, again, when playing online, man, the biggest part of the match is the stamina battle. That is the biggest battle within the online matches is the stamina war. So the fact that you can make your opponent waste two bars of stamina immediately after you put your combo on them, you can't really beat that. So again, that's why I prefer Super Explosive Wave. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. And as always, man, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the support. Cavi Squad Tournament of Skill video is probably out already. If it's not, it'll be out today for sure. Sorry, guys. I know I've said this for a couple days, a couple videos now. I've just been real busy. Like yesterday, I was literally at my school for like six, seven hours. It was just absolutely insane just waiting on advising and things like that. So I've really been busy with other things. But... Again, Cabby Squad Tournament Skill video will be out today no matter what if it's not already out, guys. But as always, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and hope you guys found it useful. Until next time, hope you guys have a good day as always. Peace, y'all.